All right, everybody, it's me, Hi. Dr. Ryan Packard. Hi, nice to see you. I've got yes. a lovely guest with me. I'm Gracie. Gracie. Gracie has agreed to talk to us a little bit about her Invisalign journey. First, we're going to show where she came from, okay? And then we're going to show where she is now, and then we're going to ask her lots of questions. So it's going to be lots of fun. Here we go. This is where Gracie started. Okay. This was our bite on the side. Look at that, a little bit of overjet. Our canines weren't lined up right there. We had a class two molar. Some baby tooth. Okay, let's go over here. Baby teeth in the back. Canine relationship, still a little bit of class two on this side. All right, now let's look at the individual teeth. Whoop, there's our top teeth. All right, a little bit of crowding, just, just mild, mild, not Teeth not too crazy. Got a baby tooth there. And then on the bottom, right there. This canine right here, crowded out and it's also down. So a lot of movement to do, lots of fun. Okay, let's go back here. All right, so Invisalign. First, let's have us take a nice peek. There's your face. <laughs> Hello. Okay, it's not really big for us, so you can see. Look at that. Bite down. Turn your head this way. Turn your head that way. Ladies and gentlemen, those teeth are much better now. Tell us a little bit about your journey. So if you had to do it again, how, how has Invisalign been in general? Um, so in like second and fourth grade, I had braces and I've had Invisalign since seventh grade and I'm a freshman now. So I think like between the two, definitely Invisalign is better because you have a lot more like freedom, like not saying that you can take them out all the time, but like if I'm, I just have more freedom to eat the foods that I want. So I know like whenever I had braces, like you couldn't eat like popcorn and stuff. And I never really listened to the rules, but you still aren't like supposed to. Didn't listen to the rules? So, but like with Invisalign, it's much more comfortable and you have a lot more freedom on like kind of what you can eat and when you like if there's something that like you don't want to wear them at all then you don't have to but like still put them on because you're supposed to wear them okay hey, because we were just talking with you and your mom and she made that really good point she said the key is to what wear them wear them so if you don't wear them if you don't wear them enough it's not going to work and you have done a great job so wearing was key how was it trying to wear them that much mm -hmm. is it hard to wear them more than 20 hours a day i think it's definitely not as bad like at home but whenever you're at school like obviously if you're sitting at the lunch table you don't want to like take out your Invisalign in front of everybody because it's a little weird. <laughs> so like, like I would just like go to the bathroom or whatever and take them out. So that's the only part that I think got a little bit like frustrating at some part. Like, but once you kind of like map out like places or like ways you can take them out without people seeing, it's much easier and it's definitely worth it. Because the, the spit come out with the trays? Yeah, and you just like take, put in your hands in your mouth. So was that the hardest part or was, what well, was, was, was there a hardest part about the Invisalign? Yeah, I would say that that's just, just kind of like taking them out whenever you have to eat. Because then like if somebody like offers you a snack in class, you have to be like, no, I'm Invisaligning because you don't want to take them out in, front of them, like, in class. So you can't snack in class or at least it's harder. Okay, yeah. okay. Tell me this, what about cleaning your teeth and cleaning the trays? Was that a hassle? Was it easier? I think definitely at the beginning, I was like, put them in like clean water like all the time. And I was much more adamant about cleaning them. But then like, once you like, if you brush your teeth and you brush your Invisalign every night, then like you should be fine. You don't have to like go through a lot to clean them. What about when you ran out of trays and you went to, instead of wearing them all the time, you were wearing them at night, what was that like? I was always so happy whenever I get to wear them at night because then you don't have to wear them to school. But it's a little bit harder to remember. That way you still put them on at night. But I always remind myself just by like putting them by my sink or like next to my bed, no way I could forget. Tell me, what was the best way to help you remember to wear the trays? There was like a lot of times where I lost my Invisalign, so like I didn't know what to do, but I've become much better about just putting them like in the case in my bathroom. That way I won't lose them and I won't forget them because I think that was also another challenge. Just kind of like you have to keep track of them or else that defeats the purpose of wearing them all the time. So do you think that this works really well for people that aren't good at remembering or? Maybe not because if you don't remember to wear them, then there's no point because braces, they're in your mouth all the time. So you don't have to like take care of them except for brushing your teeth. But with Invisalign, it's just a little bit more of a responsibility to remember to wear them. Okay, is there anything that you can think of that you would want to know 
difficult. Or getting this, you're like, I wish I didn't know that. Or that you think somebody else might want to know. I think the only other thing is maybe like the chewies. Ooh. At the beginning, I like didn't use them at all, and I was really bad, but like now I use them a lot more. That way I can just be done faster. That's really good. That's really good. So the chewies are those like little white things that you bite on rubber and you kind of squeeze, help the tray fit better, right? Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, well, and this is the way things look now. Look at that. She totally changed her bike with rubber bands, Invisalign, excellent wear. Very nice. All right. Well, Gracie, hello again. She did an excellent job with the Invisalign. Listen, this is the key. It can work. There may be some different efficiencies and benefits of braces versus Invisalign, but it can definitely work if you wear the appliance and she did a great job. So way to go. Thanks for sharing. <laughs> Congratulations on wonderful teeth. If you want wonderful teeth like Gracie and you'd like to consider Invisalign, come find us in McKinney and Anna, Texas or share this with your friend. That's all I've got. Just a little PFO one so you know where you're going. Pack it out.